First, in tonight's news for your health, powered by HealthKey.com, February is Heart Month, and we continue our focus on the heart with a recently FDA-approved heart procedure at Penn State Hershey Medical Center. Yeah, the medical center has played an important role in getting this procedure FDA-approved, and their hard work has paid off for some patients. Ron Spots has never had a heart attack, but a bad case of viral pneumonia caused his heart to fail. And being over the age of 65, Ron was not a candidate for a heart transplant. When he arrived at the Penn State Hershey Medical Center, he asked for a device that, until this January, was in the trial stages, a left ventricular assist device known as the HeartMate 2. The HeartMate 2 doesn't replace the natural function of the heart. Instead, it works along with the patient's heart to pump blood. It goes in and through my stomach right here and goes over and hooks into the pump. A flexible tube is attached to the pump and is pushed through the patient's skin and connects to a small battery-powered controller outside the body. The important thing they are adding quality of life of the of those uh, patients with end-stage heart failure. Um, within a month of him being released from the hospital, we took a day trip to New York, you know, so we travel a lot. We've been to Tennessee. We've been to Florida. We've been to New York. Ron works every day, got back on a pair of skis, and has even gotten to some of those household chores his wife has been bugging him about. Uh, my son and I put uh, a ceramic tile in the, the bathroom, which she's been after me to do for four or five years now. Ron says it's not just the equipment that keeps him going. The smaller part of this whole thing is the equipment. The, the other thing that is an absolute necessity is to keep your mind positive. Well, Penn State Hershey Medical Center has been participating in the trial for the HeartMate 2 since 2006 and since then has performed 46 successful HeartMate 2 implants.